of those are me. It just, it's just the computer saying Ogbomo Show. I think it says it like seven times. Ogbomo Show. That's, that's quality entertainment. Strike I don't understand how that only has 33 like views. In a cemetery of all places. If I had to guess, I'd say the aliens intentionally picked the most centralized location they could find. If we don't disarm the weapon before it reaches full power, the surrounding city will be completely wiped out. Objectives updated. Moving to target location. Moving. Good copy, moving on target. Got it, moving. Confirmed, closing on target position now. This is a fairly Ignition. difficult bomb disposal map. I think whether a bomb disposal is difficult or not is almost entirely based on okay. how large the map is. Also, in this one, we go down this ledge to start moving, which makes it really hard to evac. We have to get all the way to the stairs and back. Not that, not that I'm expecting to need to evac, but that has come up in my life. Eyes open. Uh, I got one surviving base defense rookie, I think, Findal. Yeah, I had three private first classes. Barracks, and now I have four. Through no fault of my own, aye, aye, I will point out. I tried my best, but uh, the rookies put up a got eyes on the AO. considerable fight. Happy floaters. That should be fun. Yep, that pod is three heavy floaters. This pod is two and a quarter heavy floaters. Heading there now. That's affirmative. Move it out. I've always felt like my Rocketeers needed to be flying. Let's see how that goes. Overwatch, Roger. Often big. Gonna put a chem grenade here and expect it to hit like four floaters on average next turn or something. Floaters are pretty dumb. They are not, shall we say, the brightest. We have eyes on the target. Scanning. Target acquired. Let's see how these dastardly late game enemies fare. Against uh, eight almost entirely randomly selected XCOM soldiers. I think they're all dead already. Headed there now. That's just bad luck. Just bad luck. That was rough, players. I really thought you had that one. Okay. Let's hit this thing. Power nude, power down. Keep moving pretty quick. 
Found nine enemies so far. I expect there are 15. I'd guess there are 15. Plus the drop-ins after. I feel, Commander. Reloaded. That's affirmative. It takes us one bad turn and we're just dead. Heading there now. Good old bomb missions. Heading to that location. Oh boy. Ich mach mich los. Heading to that location. Oh, come on, Paul, please. Commander, we're detecting an energy buildup in the area. That bomb is going to reach full power any minute now. I wonder if we're uh, in a situation where I have to think yet. I feel like we're approaching it. Rockets away. Here, Revo, how's it going? Ritza has that many hit points. Headed there now. Let's just do it like this. Big brother is online. Wait, what really? Where is it? Lights out on that power node. So it has to be just back here. This is also that's pretty crappy. Okay, that's crappy too. Why are you so cruel to me, XCOM? We don't have a flamethrower on that mech. Don't know why we don't have a flamethrower on this mech. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Where's the panic button? Almost works. Headed there now. Kill confirmed. Hey. Oh yeah, I'm late game XCOM. That's reassuring. Okay. You're dead. Drinks are on me. I think we shoot this. Whoa, -ho -ho, you're dead. They're all dead. Drop one of these. Wait a second. Is that true? How do they hold their guns? 
Oh, you mean the chrysalids. The chrysalids don't have thumbs. Floaters have very ugly hands. I don't consider myself, like, a huge authority on the attractiveness of hands. I'm no Derek Zoolander. But, uh... X-ray neutralized. Wow. That was an ugly hand. On my way. Ihre Angriffe sind bedeutungslos. Sie treten den Rückzug an. down. That'll buy you some time. Gotta be getting close to the bomb. Heading there now. Should be in this corner. We can actually go grenade launch right here, even though it's a consumable. We're not going to need this many of them, and it keeps bullets in the gun. We care about actions here a little bit more than we care about consumables. I think there's another pod I would love to be Big able to see it. Online. I'm on it, Commander. I'm Overwatch. Enemies in sight. Adjust your name. Negative. You guys should all die somehow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. Rockets away. Yes, please. You know I'll take it. Oh fuck. Joy here. Okay. I'm not sure how long I can maintain this. I'm about to start keeping score. Dead Use some ammo over here. Is 28 the biggest hit of the campaign? 28 might be the biggest hit of the campaign. It's a very large number, 28. That's affirmative. You've bought yourself some time, but you still need to hurry. Your, well, you know. The Smurf. Heading to that location. I find the early game to be really? largely Looks about like found the, bomb. the alien bomb AI sucking stew, and then. Updated. I find late game to be largely about 
killing the aliens before they're terrible yeah, AI can do anything. Moving to position. Uh, overall, I enjoy both quite a lot. Good work. I think Don't early game... More time, but you still need to find that bomb. Early game Long War 1 is definitely more polished, but it's also more explored. Which means that people really understand some things that they can get away with, which they maybe shouldn't be able to get away with. It breaks the game down a little bit. Give me some thin mana. Now you just need to take out any active hostiles still in your locale. Stay alert, Strike One. You've got hostile forces about to hit your position. New objective received. Smurf, I modded you so that you could uh, kill civilians with your rockets in real life. Metaphorically. I mean, I would prefer you not really do that, but I guess I can't stop you. It must feel so helpless to be a fit man in late game XCOM. Kill confirmed. That's affirmative. I sort of feel bad for them. Spotted. I'm pinned down here. In order to become a mod of this channel, Stu, you have to be here when no other mods are here. And, like, catch me in the right mood. That's the method of job promotion in this channel. I don't know if that says Sundance or Five Undance. How would one undance? like uh what i'm dancing on webcam and then i come to regret it i use my undance ability what if everyone was born with nine undances and throughout your life you could uh you could dance with reckless abandon knowing that anything embarrassing that you did you could just use one of your undances on it we're always glad to have more help down here uh, anyway, Sundance, probably. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Hope you've been enjoying the show. Appreciate the support. Bye, Sundance. Uh, side training is going. Van Dorn is now at a high enough mission chance. Mission count, mission whatever. To learn mind control. I always think there are more options in late game XCOM. So many ways to wreck people. Yeah, that's true. There are a lot of different ways to kill things in late game XCOM. It actually makes it really hard to talk about like how you're meant to play XCOM. Because there are so many different things you can do which end up leaving you in like a reasonable position to kill everything in late game. Thanks for the follows, d -tubs. Welcome to the stream. Stew tubs. I just don't know what stew tubs means at all.
General's out for four more days. I guess while he's side training, we'll do our base assault. I'm gonna wait for the Joker boss. My mech's doing. They're like on their way. Slowly. Probably wait another week. Get them all. Mech defender two in eight days. Get nine of them. I like what you did there. I see what you're up to. I see what you're up to. Contact detected. Got a fighter on an air raid. This might be the moment. This might be the moment for my robot army to shine. What's uh Oh. Oh. Oh, it's over Nigeria. Ogbomo show. All right. We can't have that. Suit. That's for sure. Approaching target now. Sectoid, sectoid commander. Those guys seem like they would be absolute shit against Chivs. Cyberdisc might be a problem for ballistic weapon Chivs. Then again, it might not be. We can't say for sure until we've tried. There's got to be a better interface, right? There just has to be a better interface than this. The world just isn't ready for it yet. It's probably the issue. Suppress the disc? <laughs> Don't think we'll be suppressing the disc. You may be overestimating how much equipment I've built for my shivs. I don't know, do we put them with core armoring? Like, it's free. It's a good item. I guess we do. We've got enough alloys to replace it, is what I mean. When I say that it's free, it's obviously not actually free. Why is he going 100% show? Why is he going? <laughs> Questions like that are never going, <laughs> never going to receive satisfactory responses. Oh, Fuzzy Wolf, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream, Fuzzy Wolf. Hope you're enjoying the show. Sprinter Resilience. Thunder 2, Thunder 3, Thunder 4, Thunder 5. I wonder what these look like on my overlay. It didn't work, did it? Oh, it did work. They look like little white boxes. Some of them have hollow targeting. Okay. Glad you could catch it, Fuzzy Wolf. Here at the beginning of the end. Finally we have deployed the robots. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Ogbomo show.